Welcome to the Communication and Mass Media Complete Advanced Tutorial. Use the control bar to pause the tutorial at any time. Use speakers or headphones to listen to the audio. You may need to use the scroll bars to adjust the tutorial on your screen. To start, we select the Advanced Search link. The default search mode in this example is Find All My Search Terms. In this case, Communication and Mass Media Complete puts AND between all the words we type in each text box. Boolean search allows us to enter words joined by AND, the same as find all my search terms, OR, the same as find any of my search terms, or NOT, useful for eliminating words we don't want. Phrase search looks for all the words we enter together as a phrase. This needs to be used carefully or we'll get zero results. Some words such as A, FOR, THE, etc. are not searched in a phrase search. Apply related words, search as synonyms and plurals of our search terms, giving us more results. Also search within the full text articles gives us many more results. However, it includes any mention of the search terms and they may not be the main topic of the article. Smart text searching allows us to enter a block of text, such as the abstract of an article, and search for relevant articles. This search should be used with caution as it often retrieves very large numbers of hits. Usually, it's better to extract key concepts from the article and search for those. Don't check full text as this limits searches to articles available full text through EBSCO. Articles may be available full text in another database to which the library subscribes, but they won't appear if we check full text. The Advanced Search tab allows us to perform more precise searches than the basic search. Be careful when choosing limiters. Communication and Mass Media Complete is not a particularly large database and too many limiters will give us zero results. We're interested in researching issues of communicative competence for learners of Japanese, so we enter our first search terms. When we search communicative competence using the default keywords search, we get 779 results. The drop-down menu provides a number of ways to limit our search. We can improve our results and reduce the number of hits by searching for keywords from the article abstract, AB. Terms found in the abstract are more likely central to an article's theme than those found scattered throughout the article. We redo our search. This reduces our hits to 366. To view our results, we toggle shut the search history alerts. Once we have some results, a number of other ways to narrow our results appear to the left. EBSCO generates a list of useful subject terms based on our initial search. We choose language and languages, which is automatically added to our search. We also add Japanese as a keyword. And search. This reduces our results to seven relevant hits. Let's clear the search boxes and try another search, this time using truncation. We're interested in information on bilingual speakers of French, so we enter bilingual asterisk. This will search all forms of the terms such as bilingual, bilingualism, etc. We click Search. We add a second term, Communication. We choose a subject heading from the list on the left. We select the second language acquisition subject term. We add another search term, French. Notice that the search terms we've already used are listed below our results. We can eliminate a search term by clicking the X after it. We can also search for our terms individually by clicking the linked term. We limit our search to author-supplied keywords. This reduces our hits to 5. If this is too few, we can always go back and remove some of our limiters. 
This ends the Communication and Mass Media Complete tutorial. For more tutorials, return to the menu.